In this video for the Swash 1400, we're going to learn about the pressure settings for the wash, the nozzle position settings, as well as the spray width settings. So for the pressure, we're going to use the plus and the minus buttons here on the remote. These buttons should be pressed while the wash is running. If the wash is not running, these buttons won't do anything. So you would start the wash and then while the wash is running, adjust the pressure using the plus and minus buttons. The nozzle position, uh, the Swash 1400 offers seven nozzle positions front to back and these arrows allow you to adjust that as well. Now the spray width is unlike the other two features we talked about in this video in the respect that it has a light that works along with it to let you know what option is selected. Blue would be the most narrow of the spray widths. Pink would be the middle spray width and then red would be the widest of the spray widths. Now it's important to keep in mind that as the width of the spray increases, Brondell does not increase the water flow. So you're getting the same amount of water but over a wider surface. So a wider spray means also a weaker spray, which can be a downside, but also if you're looking for something that's a little bit less harsh, that wider spray might be a good way to get a less harsh spray as well. MiniLittleBidets.com, where we sell mini bidets, not mini bidets.